Importance of Lightning Protection and Earthing Lightning is an awe-inspiring natural phenomena that can discharge up to 200,000 amps in a fraction of a second. A direct strike can have devastating effects on people, buildings and the natural environment. Especially during stormy seasons, we witness numerous accounts of people losing their lives due to lightning strikes. Beyond this obvious impact of lightning, the voltage spikes that accompany even indirect strikes can be catastrophic to a building's electronic systems. With the advent of sensitive electronic equipment in our everyday life, the importance of proper protection has become critical. In order to fully protect themselves, buildings and other structures must use lightning protection and earthing equipment that has been designed and tested according to the best international standards. Axis products, which are designed in accordance with these international standards, help customers identify the risks and solutions to any lightning protection and earthing needs. This video aims to take you through a brief technical understanding of the best practices and products as defined in various international standards. Standards The International Electrotechnical Commission prepares and publishes international standards for all electrical, electronic and related technologies and is the leading international organization in its field. IEC 62305 Protection Against Lightning is the apex level document that informs the standards for lightning protection around the world, accesses risk assessment software and our lightning protection and earthing products are designed to work with systems designed as per IEC 62305. UL and CSA are North American certification bodies that are followed widely in the US, Canada and other parts of the world. UL467 Grounding and Bonding Equipment UL96A Installation Requirement and C22 for Lightning Protection System are few important standards in this field. Lightning Protection System Design The first step in designing a lightning protection system is risk assessment. AXIS has used the guidelines of IEC 62305 Part 2 to design a risk assessment software that allows you to assess the risks and determine the class of lightning protection system, LPS, for your structure. This software uses parameters unique to your structure to help you determine the best and most efficient protection system. Based on this, you can now design the external and internal protection systems for your building. The external protection system would include an air termination, down conductor and an earth termination system. For internal protection, one would use surge protection devices and equipotential bonding. Air termination The positions of the air termination can be decided based on the rolling sphere method, the protective angle method and the mesh method. The rolling sphere method can even be used to define the zones of protection for structures with complex geometry. The radius for the sphere is determined directly from the class of LPS. The protective angle method is used for simple structures, but only up to a certain height as determined by the class of LPS. The mesh method is best used for flat surfaces where the air termination conductors are to be placed at the roof edges and where no other metallic structure will be above the air termination system. Axis air termination rods made from high-grade electrolytic copper provide the highest conductivity that allows the flow of lightning strikes without any damage to the structure or equipment. Down conductors Down conductors connected to the air termination system with suitable access products 
should take the most direct route down the structure with spacing between each one defined by the class of LPS. Since IEC 62305 also allows the use of rebars inside concrete structures as down conductors under certain conditions, AXIS offers specially designed products to use this technology effectively. Earth Termination An earth electrode should provide low electrical resistance with the earth to allow for the dissipation of currents. It should also be resistant to corrosion because it will be buried underground for a long period of time. Worldwide, one of the most popular earth electrodes are copper bonded earth rods which comply with IEC 62561 Part 2. Since electricity is a surface phenomena, the copper layer allows for a conductive path while the inner core of high-strength steel provides the strength required for driving the rod inside the ground. Axis copper-bonded earth rods have been approved by utilities across the world and continue to be popular due to their consistently high quality. Internal LPS The two major components of internal LPS are equipotential bonding and surge protection devices, SPDs. The purpose of equipotential bonding equipment is to bring all the metallic parts and equipment in a structure to the same voltage potential to avoid hazards to human life or other damage. SPDs protect electronic devices by breaking the circuit in case of an equipment or system fault. Since 1994, Axis has continued to manufacture and supply high-quality lightning protection and earthing equipment internationally. We have a proven track record of high-quality protection. Our customers include utilities, government organizations and private projects across the globe. For more information, please contact us or watch our other videos.